How you going guys and welcome back to another Swan Bullion video. We've got a little goodie bag full of some Perth Mint December releases. I can't wait, so let's get stuck into it. If you don't want to miss out on our videos and the release of different coins, bards, stackers and more, hit that like, follow and subscribe button to stay in the loop. They'll be linked in the description down below. Now back to the video. The Phantom is an iconic character and comic strip created by Lee Falk in 1936 and something I used to read in the Saturday paper when I was growing up. A seemingly immortal hero, having been around since 1536, he is in fact the 21st member of a crime-fighting dynasty who all adopt the same costume persona. Like his predecessors, the Phantom relies on his strength, intellect and legendary immortality to overcome evil. The obverse features the mirrored Ian Rank Brawley effigy of Queen Elizabeth over a frosted background. With 1 ounce weight, 49 silver purity, 2022 20, year date, and $1 to value denomination. There is a 25,000 maximum mintage with a 1,000 piece issue limit on this in card release. On the reverse, we can see a mirrored depiction of the Phantom in his trademark bodysuit and mask on a frosted background featuring motifs from his skull ring and good mark ring. Above him is a stylized The Phantom inscription in a half mirrored, half frosted style finish. I'm really loving this coin from designer Natasha Mule. What do you guys think? Next we have the new Baby Luna coin with this year's Baby Rabbit half ounce silver proof coin. Last year's Baby Tiger was a bit of a hit and miss with collectors, but this year we've seen the Baby Rabbit sell out with Perth Mint incredibly fast. The obverse of this coin features a frosted in rank Brawley effigy of the Queen over a mirrored background with half ounce weight, 49 AG purity, 2023 20, year date and 50 cents to value denomination. There will only be 7,150 of these coins minted. The reverse of this coin features a very cute coloured illustration of a baby rabbit in a grassy patch of buttercups. By the way, a fun fact, today I found out that baby rabbits are called kittens. Also featured on the reverse is the Chinese character for rabbit, as well as the inscription year of the rabbit. Also found is the Perth Mint P Min Mark. I'm really liking the colouring on this coin, as well as the design choice to colour more aspects of the background than we saw in last year's release. Finally, we're on to the star of the show, the 2022 Ouroboros 2 ounce silver antique coloured coin. As you avid watchers would know, I'm a huge fan of antique coins, so I've been incredibly excited to see this one in person. So let's not buck about and we'll pop her open. As you can see, this comes in a clear acrylic display case with magnetic lid. The coin shape comes from two powerful symbols, the Ouroboros, or a snake eating its own tail, and the infinity symbol. The obverse features a series of lines converging together in the center of the coin behind a coin shaped negative space, featuring the Jody Clark effigy of the coin. The lines disappearing tricks the eye to whether they are merely circular lines or endless lines traveling for eternity in their looping infinity shaped path. Featured following the path of lines are the inscriptions Elizabeth II, Australia, $2.02 .02 ounce 49AG with 2022 underneath the coin's effigy. A super clean inscription layout. On the reverse is the Ouroboros. A snake eating its own tail to represent the regenerative cycle of life, enlightenment and renewal. This antiqued piece is further enhanced with variegated tinting along the snake's head and body with complementary colours of blue and gold. Also included in the design is the Perth Mint's P Mint Mark, as well as the initials of designer Monique Reeves. I definitely think this one's going to be insanely popular and with a 2,000 piece mintage limit, they will be really hard to get a hold of. 
This one lived up to the expectations, even surpassing the product images released by the Perth Mint. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments down below. If you'd like to pick any of these up, they'll be linked in the description down below. Thanks for watching the video guys, I hope you enjoyed this one and we'll see you in the next one.